In science today, we are going to be remembering the parts of a plant. Now, you have learnt this with Mrs Dodman, and I know that you learnt this when you were in kittens, because I taught it to you in the summer term when we were working together then. So I am expecting you to be able to do this without any problems. The first task that you have today looks like this. You've got your picture of a plant. At the bottom here, you've got your keywords, the stem, the flower, the root and the leaf. You need to name each part of the plant using the key here, okay? So uh, at the bottom here, what are these called? That's the roots. So you would write roots in this bit here. I would like you to pay special attention to your spelling. So if you're unsure about how to spell something, then come back and look on this side to check your spellings. After you've done that, you are going to have a look at your knowledge organisers. Now this knowledge organiser is telling you all about wild plants. Wild plants grow naturally and are not helped to grow. Some examples of common wild plants are buttercups. Sometimes you might see them in the summer. Sometimes people put them under their chins and if it glows yellow on your chin, they say that you like butter. Stinging nettles, we've all fallen in some of them before, haven't we? A dandelion, a daisy, and ivy. Over on this side, we've got garden plants. These are any plants that are chosen and helped to grow. They are cared for to make the place look and feel pleasant. Some common garden plants, some flowers, lots of us grew these last time when we were in lockdown, didn't we? Tulips, grass, a pansy, roses and lavender. Now your task, you have got on your task sheet, which you'll find on your Sway um, canvas, you have got two groups. You've got to sort out the wild plants and the common garden plants. Okay, so for example, you've got your sunflower there. Is that going to be a common wild plant or a common garden plant? If you're not sure, then look back at your knowledge organiser and think, oh, where's that sunflower? Is it on this one? No, it's on this one. It's a garden plant. So we would pop that one into the garden plants. Now you can cut these out and stick them on your bit of paper. Or if you don't want to do that, you can draw them. It's up to you how you want to do it. I've got a stinging nettle. Now is it a stinging nettle, a wild plant or a garden plant? That's right, it's a wild plant. And my last example is lavender. Remember, if you don't know, then look on your knowledge organiser strips. Where was lavender on there? That's right, it's down here. So it's going to be in the garden plants. Oh. Didn't like that, did it? In the garden plants. There we go. That is the first part of your challenge.